are you? Really? You're not... Barbara. I always knew that you would endure. That's right. I am a lord. Lord of light and father of all gods. Why don't you fight Saurine yourself? I assume you're much stronger than he is. There was once a war among the gods. As a result, the world was dead for a time. That is how fierce the fighting was. I do not ever want that to happen again. But what if I can't beat Saurin? Do you really want to pin all of your hopes on me? Every person has the right to decide his or her own destiny. You can stand idly by while Saruin revives. You can be beaten by him. Or you can destroy him once and for all. The choice is completely up to you. The fact is, you know the outcome of this, right? That's why you can be so carefree about letting me decide. Not even the gods can see that far into the future. I had no way of anticipating just how much the strain of confinement would feed Saruin's hatred. Who could imagine that this would give birth to such foul creatures as Saruin's minions? I had no idea that the Fate Stones would throw the world into such turmoil. What has come to be is all my fault. Hmm, is that so? I guess I'll have to fight for both of us to see who wins. That's a hefty burden. But I've got no choice, do I? Don't be too disappointed if I don't win. I have a deep and abiding affection for this world and all that is in it. Therefore, I will not interfere. I will respect the fate it chooses for itself. Saruin awaits beneath Isma's keep. You can reach his abode through the nearby caves. Did you collect all of the items here? If you are ready, I shall send you on your way. 